first thing we're doing is just sterilizing everything <clears throat> with 100% grain alcohol. So this is 100 grams. <clears throat> We're going to put it in a 60 milliliter <clears throat> syringe so you can meter how much you take out. Okay. okay. <clears throat> so the nice thing about Flow Gel Ultra is it's by volume almost the same by weight. So if we use 60 grams of this, it'll actually be 60 milliliters. Okay. This is a hundred. Let's just do something more. <clears throat> do some reverse math. John Graham's good. There we go. So, <clears throat> what we're going to do is so we know that's a 29 gram container. Mm -hmm. So what's, I'll let you do the math. What's 60 minus 129? Well, that's 60, 70, 89, right? You mean 129 minus 60? Yeah, that's okay. it. Yeah, is that, that's 89, right? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Did you freeze this? No. Didn't freeze at all. Mm -mm. Okay. Now, 129 minus 60 would be 70, what, or 169. This doesn't look like. Well, let's do our best with it. You know what? Let me sterilize a spoon. <clears throat> separated a little bit but that's okay okay so what did what was the math you just came up with 129 mm -hmm. minus uh, 60, 60 would be 69 okay so this has to weigh 69 <clears throat> 59 okay so we're 10 over that's okay we'll end up a little extra okay So the nice thing about Flow Gel Ultra is you just have to add whatever it is that you want to add to it. Mm -hmm. I just got the, I'm just going to have to move it around a little bit to get it to all blend back together because it got kind of clumpy. <clears throat> just prep it. <clears throat> this is so simple because Flow Gel Ultra has everything in it mm -hmm. that you need, you just have to add the peptide powder to it. Gotcha. <clears throat> and then you have to just spend time blending it together. Now obviously we've sterilized everything. <clears throat> We're gonna start out with these two peptides. And in this case, that's a video, right? Yes. Okay, good. I'm just going to hold them up for the camera so people can see what they are. All right? Lipopeptide and Syncol, and these are both cosmetic peptides. So your objective with this is what? To help build collagen, get rid of fine lines and wrinkles, right? Right. <coughs> and increase Which? hyaluronic acid production. Do you know how, excuse me, 
how Flo Jo Ultra got into the United States? No. Me. Really? Yeah. I was the first person to import it into the United States. Oh, God. This is back in 97. Uh-huh. <clears throat> and I used to use it to make transdermal trenbolone mm -hmm. for me and my friends. <laughs> Now we just have to spend some time mashing it all together. This is the most superior transdermal in the world, but the nice thing about it is it has amazing <clears throat> cosmetic qualities. And what I mean by that is it makes your skin supple and smooth. It doesn't dry it out. It actually has a little vitamin E in it. Uh, the vitamin E is actually part of the transdermal blend, but the end result of this is this is a lecithin-based organogel designed specifically to compound drugs into and deliver through the skin. But it makes your skin look like you just put lotion on. And I also read it leaves, leaves very little residue <clears throat> on the skin. No, no residue. Gotcha. You, won't, you, don't, you won't have anything left on the skin. <clears throat> But it will carry just about everything put in it through the skin over the course of about an eight hour period. Wow. Yeah, it's very good stuff. And now we just have to mix it for a while. In fact, you can pause the camera if you want. Okay. So, <clears throat> I've been mixing it for at least five minutes now. Now we're just gonna gather it all up we're going to open up a brand new 60 milliliter syringe and then we'll figure out our concentration and obviously storing this in room temperature all you need to do because if you no refrigerator if you don't if you refrigerate it it'll it'll actually you can smell the alcohol from when this was sealed up right um, if you refrigerate it it'll separate it'll separate and this is the, just a slow process All you do is just slowly work it in there. Mm -hmm. Get all the excess because we're, we're going to get all of this in there. And then do the math. Yeah, we'll do the math afterwards. <clears throat> Once we see how many milliliters we have all together. We know we put 200 milligrams of each of these peptides in there. Did you notice how both of those are 200 milligrams, but... The sinkhole was far less than the... Yes. So, because you're dealing with weights, not volumes. Okay. You know? Mm -hmm. So, the milligram weight of one is less, so you end up with more powder. Right. And you can do this with nasal sprays. So there's a lot of peptides right now mm -hmm. that, like oxytocin, right. that people are saying, well, it's better de delivered as a nasal spray or PE2228 for depression. Mm -hmm. So you go out and you can buy saline mm -hmm. in the store, just regular saline. Right. And you can do the same thing with nasal spray. You can put your peptides in that nasal spray and use that to deliver your oxytocin or your PE2228 Um intranasally. In fact, I'm going to do another video sometime right. showing how to compound and, and produce your own nasally uh, delivered peptides. And you want to get as little wasted as possible. That's the objective here. Right. And when we're done, we're going to end up with just about 
exactly 60 milliliters. Watch. That's one of the real big advantages of Flow Gel Ultra. By its volume and weight are almost exactly one to one. Right. So every milliliter is about one gram. Yeah, I cut a deal with Jim Rogers. He's the guy who, J-A-R stamps for Jim Anthony Rogers, mm -hmm. or Albert Rogers. Mm -hmm. And he lived in Calgary, mm -hmm. and he invented Flow Gel Ultra. Right. And we became friends because I was learning to compound with it. Mm -hmm. He actually had him on the show in 2006. Right. He said it was the most boring interview, most likely for my listeners, but I doubt it. I got to dig it up. Mm -hmm. and Maybe replay it. Yeah. But... We became very good friends, and uh, so I said to him, um, I'd like to sell Flow Gel Ultra in the United States to end users. No one had ever done it before, right? <clears throat> and he said, okay. So I used to buy boxes of it, and we got, so, we got, we got so big that he agreed to just drop ship from Canada for me mm -hmm. uh, to, so that I wouldn't have to do the shipping anymore because it was becoming such a pain in the neck to ship. Okay, so now I'm just going to tap it a little bit. And so uh, these little, where are they? I had a little bag of, uh, oh, there they are, black stoppers. So this is a lure lock syn syringe, which means it has threads on the end that you can put a, a needle oh. on. And I, I get these little caps that go with them. Let me do this with it. Nothing starts running out the bottom as I start doing this. There we go. And we'll see what else we can get in there. I think we're pretty much got 99% of everything in there that we need to. You may want to rub the rest of this on your skin, Billy. <laughs> I'm just going to wash the excess off the outside. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I could tell just by looking at it that we ended up with about 56 milliliters. Mm -hmm. I'm going to just let it sit like this for a little while. I'm going to let it run back down, and then we'll take that cap off in a little while and just push it all the way to the top. Take this and put it in the... So let's just do some math real quick. Let me get my phone. So, so if we have uh, 200 and 200 of each, so let's just say 400 milligrams divided by... Uh, 56 so each each line mm -hmm. is seven milligrams each one of those lines okay each mil is, is each one milliliter of the very small lines. yeah well each of these lines is one milliliter 
right? You got 10 okay. milliliters, 20 milliliters, all the way down. We, we ended up with about 56 milliliters of, of this. So each one of those is seven milligrams total, three and a half milligrams of the sinkhole and three and a half milligrams of the lipotide. Okay, lipopeptide. Okay. Right. So that's a pretty that's a pretty hefty dose. Okay. So whoever is going to be using this probably just needs to take one milliliter at a time mm -hmm. and only put it where they want it. If they want collagen under the eyes, mm -hmm. if they want it over here, just rub it in and just rub it in until it's all gone. Mm -hmm. And that's all. That's it. Okay. And, but that's how you make your own topicals at home. Okay. Now, would you need a micro needle or just rub it on? No, just rub it on. So this okay. is this this is like delivering it with micro needles. This stuff mm -hmm. is transdermal delivery for drugs. Okay. So this you don't have to inject anything. You just rub it on your skin. It's gonna it's gonna go past the stratum corneum uh -huh. and go right into the skin where you want it to be, where it's gonna work its magic. Okay. So you don't have to do anything but just rub this on. Now there's enough here for about. 56 applications. Okay. Maybe more. Mm -hmm. Because if you use less than a whole milliliter, if you know if you should, if, if the person that's using this just puts a, a bead on her finger and rubs it on here mm -hmm. and here and another bead and rubs it on here and here, or wherever it is that she wants added collagen, improved uh, skin quality, fewer small wrinkles, mm -hmm. this could last three months. Gotcha. But based on just using one milliliter at a time, it should last 56 days. Okay. And over that period of time, if you're going to see results, you're going to see results. I mean, if it, if it's working mm -hmm. for her, it's it's going to it's going to you're going to it's going to show up pretty quickly. Okay. You'll see a plumping of the skin. Mm -hmm. You'll see fine lines start to disappear. Mm -hmm. But then also the skin will start to thicken. Okay. So if somebody has that, you know, as we age, we get that wax papery looking skin. Mm -hmm. That should just go away after a couple of weeks of using this. Okay. So that's it. Hey, that's thank all there you. is to it. Thank you very much. Okay. Now you're going. So we ended up with 58 milliliters exactly, and I simply peeled the stickers off of the envelopes, and this is exactly how it would come from your pharmacy. There you go. Thank you.